Yay! Let's go fly it in a Cessna 172, everybody. Oh, it's downgraded to the backseat. But that's okay, because if you've never flown the backseat of a Cessna 172, you probably should. The views back here are arguably much better. So we decided to fly through the Rocky Mountains, because it's a perfect day to fly through the Rocky Mountains, and that's Lake Minnewanka down there, by the way. And I was using my Garmin Pilot Watch to monitor my oxygen levels, because we're at higher altitude, so I want to make sure I don't get hypoxia. And since I was in the back of the airplane, basically useless, I figured I might as well give the flight crew massages, make sure they feel comfortable. And if they do fall asleep, I can give them a little smack to make sure they wake up. We don't want them falling asleep. And because I'm in the back of the plane, I had access to the flight manual. So if there's any sort of emergency, I'm the first one to pull out the emergency checklist for them. So I kind of do have a role while we're up here cruising around. And if you haven't noticed, I'm wearing my favorite flying eye sunglasses. If you want to pick up a pair and save yourself 10%, use my discount code Evan Luck, no space. These things are basically indestructible. So once we were sick and tired of flying through the Rocky Mountains, which I don't know how you could ever be sick and tired of flying through the Rocky Mountains, we decided to come in for a silky smooth landing. But oh, no, never mind. Silky smooth was not on the menu. But whatever, the coffee was tasty and the flight was awesome.